Hello, this is Toe from Trifold Productions with another Blender quick tip. And then this quick tip, I'm going to show you how you can fix grayed out areas uh, in your Blender workspace. Uh, what happens in Blender 2.8 is when you transfer uh, elements from 2.79, which is this, to 2.8, which is this. In your outliner, sometimes you'll have grayed out sections where you can't click it or activate it or anything like that. I'm going to show you how to fix that and also uh, in this uh, part of your uh, window sometimes you'll turn you'll work on the mesh or model or import or add a mesh or model to the scene and the menu pops up here which you can actually use to manipulate the model or your mesh that you're working on but sometimes it is grayed out also I'm going to show you how you can fix that so let's go to the first part which is the grayed out sections here now this occurs when you transfer or open up a file that you started in 2.7 and you open it up in 2.8 what happens is, it, is that when you start modeling something and then you go to uh, add more parts or sections to your model and you put them in these little squares here I forgot the name of these squares uh, or these layers sorry about these layers and then you open it up in 2.78 or 2.8 uh, it's grayed out and that's why that happens I'm going to open up this that same project in 2.79 and 2.8. I'm going to go to File, Open Recent, Grayed Out uh, Sections. And now this is opened. And I'm going to pull this down a little bit so we can see the full, more of the, uh, of the uh, outliner. And as you can see, all these sections are grayed out. You're trying to figure out, okay, uh, in this part of my uh, Blender project, I've got the square here. I've got this um, sphere here. I've got a cylinder. I've got a Taurus, and then I've got Suzanne the monkey. But when I open it up in 2.8, I don't see any of that, and that's because collections is what 2.8 uses. In order to, for you to see what's in each collection, because the layers that are, are treated as layers in 2.79 and 2.8, they're treated as collections. So you're like, well, okay, that's fine. Let me click on the eye. Maybe that'll help. You click on that. Nothing happens. Nothing happens. Nothing happens. What you have to do is go up to this section here. Click on this little drop down, and you have to activate or turn on these uh, elements here because these are disabled because they've been grayed out. Click on that for the render view, and click on this for your view viewport view. And then once you've done that, you just have to click on each of these sections here and then as you can see it automatically brings up all those layers which are called collections in 2.8 and you can do the same thing with the camera you want to render all this out you have to actually also activate the camera turn that on and turn that on and so on and so forth and then it works the second thing that we did i mention earlier was having um having a menu grayed out within blend 2.8 what i'm going to do is open up a new uh project here go to new open open or file new and click on general we want to discard this we've got our cube here and I want to add a, a plane mesh because I want to add that to the cube I'm going to press shift A and plane okay that's fine you've seen the plane I want to it's with it's inside of the cube but we know it's there and when we click on this this is supposed to be able to ma manipulate this plane here but you can't do anything with it because it's grayed out you're trying to figure out, okay, why is it grayed out? Why can't I use this menu? I mean, it's there for a reason. What you have to do with this is this also. Go up to File and go actually go to Edit and Preferences. And once you've gone to Preferences, you go into System. And under System, you're going to click Global Undo. Make sure that checkbox is checked. And in Blender 2.8, it automatically saves all, all your changes uh, that you've made in the... Uh, and the uh, blender preferences let's close that out let's press X to delete that I'm gonna press shift A again and then mesh and plane and then there you go now this is working you can manipulate this just the uh, use this menu here as you would normally do <coughs> excuse me in blender without a problem so that's pretty much how you can fix grayed out areas within blender 2.8 when it comes to the outliner and it also comes to the uh, pop-up menus within the uh, window. As I mentioned before, in Blender 2.8, it treats layers 
from 2.7 as collections in 2.8 and to activate those collections in 2.8 click this drop down menu let's pull this over a little bit more so we can see this fully click this drop down menu turn on the render and also the uh, viewport render also click on those two activate those two and that will activate all your collections and in, in your project and when it comes to the grayed out sections within the uh, window here once again go to edit preferences and go to the systems aspect of your blender preferences and activate global undo and that turns on the uh, menus within the uh, window of blender well that's the uh, today's quick tip hope it helps someone and um, you guys have a great evening have a great night and uh, see you on the next one all right bye